you don't know this about me, but before I was employed by a corporate grocery store, I owned my own company. Uh, the company was called Poly Corporation. It was a tree demolition company, and what we specialized mostly was in stump grinding. That's my forte. I can run a stump grinder like nobody's business. Uh, so let's head outside. I'm going to show you some of the work that I'm doing in exchange for this parking space and sitting and building for a few weeks. This is the first part is demolition. We're getting rid of all the stumps and all the riffraff. Then we're going to be putting in some fencing. So come along outside. I'll show you around what's going on. This is what does all the hard work. Look at this monster. It's crazy. This is a stump grinder. These, this wheel spins super fast, obliterates stumps. I'm going to show you how it works in action. I'm going to run this crazy mechanical monster and start destroying stumps right now. There you have it guys, that's what the bread trucker does. <laughs> bread trucker destroys stumps. So you guys, that's what I do. That's what I do to earn my keep around here. I destroy massive amounts of wood. There's another one, huge. There's a third one up here. And the biggest one, it's over here. In the bright sun, you can't even see it. This thing is enormous. It took a while. This one took about an hour to get done. This one actually made a pretty good mulch. Uh, this is pine, pine mulch, but I did see a lot of termites in this, so I would not want to put this pine mulch by my house. That's kind of why he's getting rid of this. That's kind of why he's getting rid of that huge stump. inside. 
it'll be fine the hatchet the chances of the hatchet making a spark and then you don't want to do it flat like that though you want to hit it like maybe with the top corner just to pierce a little because flat edge is not gonna Thing. I'll do it. Just like this, like here, just like that. Oh, you're gonna ruin the hatchet, yeah. Go for it. Okay. I could do it like this, like. I might ruin the edge on your hatchet a little bit, but. I can't get through it. It's way thicker than. <laughs> I hope you don't get blown up. I hope you don't blow up. I don't want you to. I think it's a bad idea though. Oh my god. Already through, okay, so it's safe. Huh? It's safe now. It's safe now. Okay, I guess so. I think. You wanna keep going? Yeah, I don't wanna do it. I'm scared. <laughs> I had to do this. My brother had a he bought a house and he had to get an oil thing from downstairs, a big oil he converted the house from oil to get oil heating to gas heating. Mm -hmm. So there was a big oil thing downstairs and he fucking gave me he didn't give me an angle grinder. He gave me a sawzall. Oh my god. Ah, Jaggy ah, thing. <laughs> and then I discovered this guy a few months later and I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna kill him. <laughs> To a garbage can fire, tending to a garbage can fire. Ah, it's almost like no time has passed at all. 2004, I opened a stump grinding business, and here I am again, doing the same kind of stuff, and I don't feel a day older. Well, that's it for this episode, guys. Um, I'm just living the life up here in Oregon, laying low, building. Uh, planning, making videos, doing stump grinding, chainsawing trees, doing all sorts of stuff. Um, but I just want to thank you guys for watching my videos. Uh, thanks for coming by and commenting, subscribing, liking, sharing. Uh, you know, I, I just hit 2,700 subscribers today. So thank you to all my new subscribers. Welcome to my channel. You guys are awesome. And uh, I can't wait for more adventures. So keep on watching. We're going to be uh, showing you how to build this van, how to uh, do the van life cheap and easy. That's what it's all about. All right, guys. See you in the next video. Peace out. Lawn maintenance, hobo style. <laughs>